Hey y'all, it's Reagan with Core Reagan coming to you live from my office with a Moderna Day 2 update. Um, I woke up this morning with, with kind of a little bit of a headache, but I was able to drink coffee and have a yogurt cup, no problem. Um... I'm a little sleepy, but nothing nothing too bad. Um, last night, I went to sleep after I took a hot shower, so that was kind of nice. Um, and I, they said the next time for me to get my next dose is on... March 31st, which I believe is directly before Easter. Um, I'm just, I'm trying to make sure I keep up with fluids and eat, um, eat healthier options because next time y'all see me, I will be in Las Vegas with my family. So, I'm trying to um, make sure to keep myself as healthy as possible for this trip. We're actually celebrating my dad's birthday, which if y'all did not know, it was a few weeks ago on the 10th. Um, and we're going to Las Vegas to celebrate, and I could not be more excited. We have not traveled on an airplane I think, I think in, for me, it's been definitely two years, maybe a year and a half at this point. So, um, to say that we needed this trip is, is a definite understatement. Um, we're very excited to go. So, I will keep you guys in the loop as we take take our trip this weekend and I will show you guys the sights and sounds of Las Vegas. I just wanted to come on here real quick to tell y'all that I did finish the Zoom interview and shout out to my friend uh, Whitney Bailey who goes by the username at Wilcher Wit um, and her podcast spastic chatter which i will leave as a tag down below um we had a great conversation today and if you are a fan of podcasts then i would highly recommend that that podcast selection to y'all um as i said um i will continue this episode tomorrow and through Saturday as I take y'all along in Vegas. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Y'all, I am not, I'm not going to lie to y'all. This week was probably one of the tougher weeks that I've dealt with in a while, as you can see by my beverage in the frame. Um, earlier this week, our community lost a special lady, um, we, we all knew her as either Miss Libby or Miss Bluda. Um, she was a fabulous lady, and she, she never failed to leave you without a smile on her face. Um, she uh, left this earth due to the lovely virus, and... There is no words that I can 
describe right now. Um, other than the fact of thank you for teaching us amazing life lessons. And <clears throat> if y'all were looking forward to seeing Vegas clips this week, I did not film that those either like I thought I was going to. Um, we've just been focused on spending a lot of time as a family as of late because the past couple months our family has been put through the ringer as well. Um, yes, my mom and family has given me permission to share this on the vlog as well. Um, my grandmother, um, has been diagnosed with stage 4 mesothelioma, and she's going through treatment, and they're, they're trying their best. Um, but what we really could use right now is a lot of prayers. Honestly, um, I'll tell you straight up, I haven't trained, I haven't worked out at all lately, and I'm not going to sit here and make excuses. It's, I'm not sitting here and making excuses. I could say that grief has a lot to do with it, which it does. I'm not going to sit here and say that it doesn't. It does. Um, but, yeah, our family has been going through a lot. And so, we could really, we would really appreciate y'all's prayers. Um, and like I said, I'm sorry that I didn't get footage, actual footage for you guys from the trip. But, as I said, I'm focusing on spending time with my family now more than ever because family is family is very important. Family's never gonna leave you in the dust and it'll always be there for you. So my point to y'all this week is if you haven't hugged a family member lately or called them, do it. Do it. Um, I can't say anymore without trying not to cry. Um, <clears throat> but that's where my head is at right now. Um, I have just... Y'all know that I'm not one to sugarcoat anything when it comes to what's really going on. I've never been one... Excuse me. I've never been one to sugarcoat things since day one. And that is not my policy at all. Um, so, as I said, my family could really use y'all's support and prayers right now. Prayers of comfort would be greatly appreciated for us and my Oma. But most of all, my Oma. She... She's just tired, guys. She's, she's just tired. And we're just, we're trying to cheer her up, cheer her up and all of that. So, anyway, this is for Miss Bluda. May you rest in peace. And... 
Thanks as always for y'all's support and prayers throughout the years and months. Um, we really appreciate it. Thanks, y'all. If you enjoyed this episode at all and would like to give a thumbs up, you can do so. If you would like to subscribe and haven't done so yet, make sure to do so. Click the red subscribe button down below and also the notification bell next door to it. Um, if you would like to leave a tip or a donation, please feel free to do so at www.buymeacoffee.com slash GoReagan. All tips and proceeds and donations will go directly back to the channel itself and as always are greatly appreciated. Um, the greatest compliment y'all can give me is a referral. That means that if you see someone who needs happiness or positivity down below, I mean, happiness or positivity in their day, then please feel free to send them my link and I will be happy to help them in any way possible within reason. Thank y'all so much for your prayers and support. And I will see y'all in the next video. Also, side note. As I said, my family is going through a lot. So, the video schedule will be sporadic as we find out the next steps. Thanks as always for your support. Bye y'all.